coming to osteoarthritis osteo means bones arthritis means the joint disorder that means joint inflammation but it is a misnomer <coughs> it is a non inflammatory in nature so there is a progressive degenerative joint disorder which is non inflammatory in nature it is mainly found in the female than in the male having the body index of greater than 30 body mass index greater than 30 it is mainly found in the age group of greater than 65 years of age having a sedentary lifestyle occupational hazard and previous trauma so what happens in the osteoarthritis is that there is a joint space so there is a reduction of the joint space this is the articular cartilage this is one of the articular cartilage of the next joint so there is a destruction progressive destruction of the articular cartilage and resulting in the friction uh, and re reduction of the synovial fluid in between the joint space so this causes the friction of the two joint surface and also there is a destruction of the cartilage of uh, the synovial membrane so as a result of which there is a pro progressive inflammatory mediators which are released and interleukin 1 interleukin 6 these are released and as a, which causes the inflammation and the pain in the joint space in the joint so which joints are mainly involved the joints are knee joint in the knee joint the most common bone involved is the patella it, it can be in the hip joint in the hip joint the most common common compartment is the medial compartment the vastus medialis obliquus muscle is involved it also can involve the spine that lumbar spine or the cervical spine can also be involved it involves the first carpo metacarpal joint the first carpo metacarpal joint of the hand and the first metatarsophalangeal joint in the foot it involves mainly involves the proximal interphalangeal and the distal interphalangeal joint of the hand so this is the proximal interphalangeal joint distal interphalangeal joint and it is the proximal interphalangeal joint so pip dip joints are very much involved and in the pip joint the pouchers nodes are present and in the dip joint the harbor Harvard's nodes are present. <coughs> it was <coughs> if it is a rheumatoid arthritis, then it involves the metacarpophalangeal joint. Now, uh, what is the clinical features of the patient? Patient of greater than 60 years, female, having a pain, tenderness, and swelling in the joint. Sometimes crepitus is seen, and there is a reduction in the walking distance. So in the knee, the deformity which is most commonly seen is the genu verum. So genu verum deformity is basically seen. Now coming to the pathogenesis. So there is a articular cartilage. The cartilage contains mainly proteoglycan. <clears throat> so mainly proteoglycans is present in the articular cartilage. And there is a progressive destruction. And other, other, uh, other collagen fibers are also present. Chondroitin sulfates are present. Type 1, type 2 collagens are also present. Now there is a progressive destruction. There is increased water content and there is a progressive destruction of the proteoglycans. And there is a catabolism of the cartilage. And as a result of which the cartilage becomes weak. Over a period of year, the cartilage becomes weak and there is a cracks and fissures develop. So this cartilage will partially detach from the articular the chondrocyte cartilage these chondrocytes will be progressively uh, released and there is a destruction there is a detachment partial detachment and these are known as the joint mice so these chondrocytes are known as the joint mice which are released from the articular cartilage and these are taken up by the macrophage and creating the inflammatory mediation so this causes the complete detachment with exposed subchondral bone so subchondral bone will expose the articular cartilage is completely destructed and there is a reduction in the joint space <clears throat> so in the x-ray we will see the asymmetric reduction of the joint space and there is a resulting of the osteophyte so there is a osteophyte or the uh, projection of the bone tissues are found these are the loose bodies which are which are found and in a chronic stage this there is results in the subchondral sclerosis so there is a sclerosis and destruction of the joint space so joint space will reduce 
now what is the management there is a conservative management and there is a surgical management in a conservative management we have to give the walking stick on the opposite hand to the patient hinged knee brace non steroidal anti inflammatory drug and cox2 inhibitors like acetaminophen is used to reduce the pain and it is the most safest drug topical liniments can also be used isometric quadriceps exercise to be given precautions to be taken and injection of the hyaluronic acid to be given <clears throat> surgically we have to do the arthroscopy if any conservative management is not cured to the patient then we have to give the surgical management we have to proceed proceed for surgical management arthroscopy where there is we have to do the arthrolysis remove the inflamed tissue and the loose body or we can also do the total knee replacement or total hip replacement therapy so this is all about the osteoarthritis thank you